morning guys we are going to the rockies and there's a bad sun bear right there so uh, but it's okay you don't need to see me um we are actually heading about two and a half hours west of denver going to the iron mountain hot springs it's in uh glenwood uh colorado glenwood springs colorado um so uh it's gonna be interesting because i am not ready as far as what do we wear where do we put our stuff um any of that things or any of those things i should say uh yeah so uh and it's probably about in the 30s here i'm not sure exact temperature uh, but it's pretty cold we got our coffee we got breakfast and uh we are on our way uh so enjoy the sights see you on the other side different if you've ever been to Tennessee there's like Larry uh, if you ever been to Tennessee the Rockies and the Smokies are like apples and oranges the Rocky or the Smokies are more like rolling hills but they're big and the Smokies is just like jagged mountains like you would expect um, there's some snow up here um, literally within like five minutes the temperature went from 43 to 39 outside according to the car um, so we did upgrade to a four-wheel drive vehicle yesterday we got here just in case it decides to snow, which I think there might be a couple days where it's going to snow up in the mountains. And if that's the case, we'll probably drive back out here so we can uh, play in snow because uh, you don't get that in Florida. It is 36 degrees out, I think. Yeah. Showing a little too much skin. I don't appreciate that, but it is what it is. Um, but, uh, man, this water feels nice. It's supposed to be, <coughs> excuse me, I think it's like 14 different natural minerals in this water. This is uh, great. If you're ever out in this area, you should definitely check it out. Ourselves 
also a uh, uh, upgrade to the Donnie car. And because the computer's messing up, we get the upgrade for free. So on Donnie car, once the food gets there, of course, we don't have to wear a mask anymore. So that'll be nicer. And I think we have better seats. Uh, it'll be easier to look around than in the coach car that we were going to be in. Um, this place is pretty cool. Uh, the beautiful sunset. Um, can't really see it too much behind me, um, but it is pretty. Actually, it's going down a little bit now. It was like a, like almost like a reddish color right over the mountain. Beautiful. Uh, so uh, let's uh, see what this ride is all about. There's like 300,000 uh, lights, um, so it should be a good time. I thought I actually had meals on there, but it was just uh, basically like snacks. Uh, we had some cider on there. Um, well, okay, I wasn't going to mention it, but yes. Uh, but it's okay, I didn't really care for the drink anyways. Um, there weren't many lights. I was a little, little, uh, you know, a little lackluster compared to what I thought it was. Now, I think that would be very cool during the day. So we will do it again next time. But it's definitely worth uh, 30 bucks, I think, of what it is. That's for Coach. Um, you know, it's a little bit more if you upgrade to the to the other cars. But you do get but you do get better uh, uh, better seats and everything like that to sit in and a real table. And, uh, but it was cool. They had it decorated. Santa Claus came out. Yeah. So, but tomorrow, tomorrow is uh, the Royal Gorge train. That is something I've been looking forward to. Uh, that is more of an adult train, and uh, yeah, that's going to be great. So, we're heading back to Denver, and tomorrow morning, it'll be a new adventure. Have a good night, y'all.